And now to Encino, where people are, are finally getting what they want, the destruction of a pedestrian bridge. But there is a little pain involved. The 101 freeway between White Oak Avenue and Balboa Boulevard will be closed overnight, Saturday into Sunday morning, so crews can get that work done. And that's where KCOMINE's Jasmine Veal is live this afternoon with why the project hasn't erased all safety concerns. Jasmine? Well, Susie, it's a start. It's a big start. So this is what's happening. Caltrans crews, they are ready to tear down that pedestrian bridge that you see behind me tomorrow night. A group of Encino residents say this is a big win because they've been fighting to get this to happen for years. But they say there is much more that needs to be done to make this corridor safer. Playing some of their favorite songs, Chuck Combs and his wife set out on their daily walk Friday, planning to take the Encino Avenue pedestrian bridge over the 101 freeway. This is a resource we use quite a bit. But they found it closed. Uh, if I'd known, I would have brought a camera the last time I did it. The bridge is being demolished Saturday night by Caltrans, closing all lanes for 12 hours between White Oak Avenue and Balboa Boulevard. Transportation officials say it is deteriorating and no longer meets the height requirement for trucks. To say that we are ecstatic is an understatement. Janie Thompson is one of the community leaders who fought hard for the last five years to make sure this bridge was torn down and not rebuilt, pointing out the ongoing safety issues around homeless encampments. She and neighbors like Marshall Barth succeeded in changing Caltrans's plans to rebuild, saving millions of dollars. And there's not enough foot traffic to warrant spending $20 million. That's crazy. And the thing is, is we have Louise Avenue, which is a safe way to get across the freeway. When this thing started, I said it's an incentive for me to live a long life because I was just 84, okay? And um, I was going to make it until this darn bridge came down. Caltrans says it's now making other improvements like to the Luis Avenue Bridge, but Thompson says Caltrans needs to use the money saved to tear down a nearly identical pedestrian bridge a mile away at Amistoy Avenue and Killian Street. She gave us these pictures of that bridge in May showing the rust and the cracks, even chunks of concrete missing on the bottom. Combs says he doesn't mind changing his route if the improvements are worth it. I suppose there's no stop in progress. All right, now Caltrans told me there is no decision on whether they will tear down that other pedestrian bridge. Again, this one mile, one mile, 12 hour closure will be happening tomorrow starting at 10 p.m. Live here in Encino, Jasmine Veal, KCAL 9 News. All right, Jasmine, thank you so much.